Huang Long Meng, or Yellow Shoot Disease, HLB, was first described in India as dieback in the 19th century and has emerged as the scourge of citrus worldwide, causing losses of billions of dollars annually. Pictured here is an orchard in North India, devastated by this disease and targeted for uprooting and destruction in February 2014 by the distraught farmer. Observe the gaps in the field left by dead uprooted trees and all the remaining trees exhibiting dieback and characteristic yellowing of the sparse foliage. Trees weakened by HLB are rendered more susceptible to secondary infestation by other pathogens such as Phytophthora, which attack the roots and girdle the trunk and main branches, cutting off supply of moisture and nutrients. Characteristic streaking of roots and stems just beneath the bark and mummified fruit are a clear indication of the advanced stage of Phytophthora in the citrus grove. Symptoms of HLB are often confused for zinc deficiency. Please observe the leaves displaying zinc deficiency on the left and the characteristic mottled yellowing of HLB on the right. HLB is spread by the Asian citrus psyllid which are attracted to the yellowing foliage. Adults feed at an angle of 45 degrees to the leaf surface and are about 3 mm in length. Their red-eyed nymphal stages are concentrated on young tissue. Their feeding causes young shoots to deform, directly impacting yields. There is no known cure. Growers were losing money due to the increased cost of plant protection on one hand and reduced yields on the other and going out of business. A protein trees was not a viable option. Working over the last five years, Sequoia Biosciences, a company based in Pune, India, has developed a holistic new strategy for managing this complex problem called the STEP system. STEP is an acronym for Structured Treatment for Enhanced Productivity. Quite simply, the objective is to restore the profitability of the grower by reducing costs and increasing yields. To be successful, the system needed to be cost effective, capable of eliminating symptoms quickly, robust and easy to implement, and more eco-friendly. Observe the profuse emergence of vegetative buds within a month after the treatment was initiated in end February 2014. A citrus plant protected by chemicals shows fungal attack on the emerging inflorescence quite clearly. Many buds dehyce and do not reach maturity, affecting future yields. In contrast, the inflorescence of a neighboring plant treated with the step system observed the same day shows numerous pristine white flowers that augur well for a better future. Observe the healthy new leaves which are glossy and bereft of symptoms of HLB which can be clearly observed in the older leaves. Please see the emergence of new leaves barely two months after treatment beginning to cover the bald patches of each and every tree. Three months after the initiation of step treatment, the leaves are much more numerous and have formed fresh branches. Please observe the crowns of the trees in the orchard. There is not a bald spot in sight. The abundant shiny green fruit that indicate the likelihood of a good yield just six months into the treatment can be clearly seen. Fruit slowly ripening in the same orchard ten months after initiation of treatment indicate a promising future for this farmer. What we are now about to show you is a short film on how the citrus grow which we saw in a devastated condition just a year ago looks now and what the distraught farmer who was about to uproot and destroy has to say now. My name is Vidar Singh, I live in Shri Karnpur Tehsil, Ganganagar. Just like this plant, this plant was almost dead. So I was planning to uproot this plant, so I, I treated the plant, the, the, the Helios and the Regalis uh, and Biovac and uh, the, the Bima. I got very good results, so I was planning to uproot this. Now just see this plant, it's half dead and see the plant after, it, it was just one year back that I treated this plant. अब ये पौधा ये भी उसी कंडीशन ये तो उससे भी बेकार था। अब इसको हमने जो ट्रीट किया है, अभी इसको इसको एक साल बाद इसका देखो फूट कितना आया इसपे, और एक साइड तो बिल्कुल डेड है, आधा इसको काट दिया भी गया। 
और हमने जो जो बचा है जो थोड़ा सा हमें हरा लगा उसको हमने रखा है और उसको हमने ये स्प्रे करके ये ये दो साल पहले मैं बाग जो ले आया है बाग संभाल पहले मैं बाग दिता सी ठेके से ठेकेदार ने मेरा बाग संभाल नहीं मैं फिर दो साल बाद मैं टेक ओवर किया ये मैं जो तो टेक ओवर किया मेरा इरादा से भी सारे बूटे खाड़ दें इन्ना बुरा हाल सगा तो मैं जो तो बूटे खाड़े पिलार साहब आए इतने वो कहें तू बूटे ना खाड़ जोड़ा बूटा हरा मेरी गरंटी हरा कर दूँ मैं असि आख्या चलो ठीक है जो उन्होंने रेकमेंड किया हिलोस की ड्रेंचिंग की बायोवैक लाई रिगालिस वगैरह भी दिखती ग्रैनुअल भी दिखती बीमा की स्परे दी रिगालिस की उत्ते लिक्विड की भी स्परे की वो हम साडे बूटे बहुत मतलब प्रफुल्लित है या हम सू बहुत वजिए रिजल्ट मिले इस कंपनी में पिछले साल मैंने ये सारा बाग जब मेरा खराब था एक लाख तैतीस हजार में ये पाँच किले बाग है तो एक लाख तैतीस हजार रुपये मेरे को इस पर मिला था इस बार मेरा ये बाग पाँच किले साढ़े चार लाख रुपये नब्बे हजार रुपये पर बीघा के हिसाब से गया ये मेरे बड़े भाई साहब का बाग है इसकी क्वालिटी देखिए हमारे बाग की क्वालिटी देखिए और उसके बाद आपको पता लगेगा इसके लीव्स देखिए ये जैसे छोटा है अब ये गल ही रहा है एक गोली कितनी है बाग है ये कंडीशन मेरे बाग की एक साल पहले ये कंडीशन थी जो ये नीचे ऐसा है ना इस पर तो अभी फ्रूट थोड़े बहुत लगे उस पर फ्रूट ही नहीं आ रहे थे ये कंडीशन थी इसको हमने सारे डेड लीव्स रिमूव करके रिगालिस बायोवैक और बीमा उससे सबसे ट्रीट करके इसको ड्रेंच भी किया हिलोस से ड्रेंच करके इसको हमने हमारे बाग की वो कंडीशन की पहले हमारी इससे भी ये ऐसी कंडीशन थी Please observe the trees showing a near complete reversal of dieback caused by HLB. This can be seen both from the heavy bearing and the way in which fruits are born, right from the tips of the topmost branches to the lowest. Also observe the uniform size of the fruit and not just the numbers. You will see many of the fruits are borne in bunches. This signifies reduced flower dropping from each inflorescence, better pollination resulting in better fruit set, and reduced fruit dropping earlier in the season. The ability of these trees to sustain such heavy bearing and good fruit size in each bunch indicates a free flow of nutrients and photosynthesis, which could never have happened if the phloem tissue had been blocked by HLB. This can be seen from the tree that was half crippled by HLB, whose dead branches have been lopped off. The half that survived has made a good recovery, as seen by the number and quality of fruits. The sawn-off stumps of the main branches are clearly seen. Please observe the leaves and stems. There are no visible swellings that could indicate blockage of phloem. Most leaves retain the dark green color without the characteristic mottling of HLB. Though leaf senescence is common at this time, 
This shows the vigor the orchard has regained within a year of initiation of the step treatment. The silic was observed three times during the year, but the leaves show the absence of the sooty mold fungus, an indication of severe silid infestation. The step system seems to encourage the buildup of natural enemies of the silids that suppress the pest. It's believed that the components of the step system work as antifeedants and insect growth regulators and also help crops build resistance to disease. They also seem to neutralize the toxins released by the psyllid that deform new shoots. This grower reports a yield of 51,900 kg from 280 trees of his 8-year-old orchard. A quarter of these surviving trees were crippled and stunted before the start of our treatment and the remaining were heavily infected. The full-sized trees actually averaged a remarkable 231 kg from an orchard which the farmer was to uproot. Growers all over the world now have a chance to beat a disease that was considered incurable. With a holistic system that has consistently delivered on dozens of citrus groves in North India, all in a similar state of devastation. The only system in the world that is rigorously proven under harsh conditions, with temperatures touching 48 degrees Celsius in summer and minus 1 degree Celsius in winter. The step system is surprisingly cost-effective and eco-friendly. As a bonus, this helps restore soil quality and bring down costs of management to improve yields, quality and profits. Smile, for tomorrow could be the day when you can pay back and are finally free from Liberibacter asiaticus. Bring back the sunshine in your morning glass of orange juice with a kiss from Mother Nature, courtesy the step system from Sequoia Biosciences.